Alright, hey guys, welcome back to episode 13 of What's the Haps? What are you laughing at? Laughing again. Is it the hat? No, what the Haps? Yeah, welcome back to episode 13. We're back. Oh, uh, what recently happened? The earthquake. Yeah, the earthquake. earthquake. Wait, you were sleeping. I was sleeping, man. I yeah. woke up. I had like all the group chats. Yo, yo, yo. I'm like, bro, what the f- Anyways, and then I went to work. And I'm like, earthquake, earthquake. <laughs> and it was like 4.2. I don't know what it was. But bro, awesome. Melbourne had an earthquake. People forget how to act. I went on Instagram. People's stories are like, sorry for the turbulence. They were like, oh, sorry. I just shook some ass. I'm like, what is this? Come on, man. On the IG notes, it's like, sorry, my car was revving. <laughs> <laughs> some guys like... The golf owners, bro. Yeah, yeah golf owners, beamer owners. Yeah. They're like, sorry, bro. My, I was revving my car. Well, yeah. Oh, did you feel it? Hmm? No. Did you feel yeah, it? Yeah, I did I feel it. I did feel it. Did anything like fall down in your house? Nah, or nothing fell. I felt it. I was on call with someone. I'm like, bro, I think an earthquake happened. They're like, nah, it's just a gust of wind. I'm like, no wind's making, <laughs> no wind can make me feel, I'm in Dufton, okay? No wind is strong enough to make me feel Dufton in Springville. Yeah. No wind is shaking that much. Yeah. One of my workmates said his walls are cracked. Really? Yeah, there's like, it's not big cracks, but it's like slight lines in between the walls and stuff. Damn. Yeah, I guess. Obviously, he's everywhere differently, but... Yeah, I mean, shit. So, Melbourne standards is pretty big. 4.2? Yeah, I don't know if that's big or not. Like, it's because I'm pretty sure where Australia is, the tectonic Bruh, plates I've under us. A, a thunder, thunder makes more than 4.2. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't know. No, I saw some oh. comments, some troll comments saying that. Maybe, might be, but yeah. Where Australia is, it's hard for it to like be really big earthquakes. I think it's like pretty impossible, but... So, mm. 4.2 is... I guess pretty big. I think it was rough. I don't know if it was rougher than the one in 2021. Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah. Were you awake for that one? I was at work for that one. Oh, really? In the afternoon, yeah. Oh. I was on the top of a factory, like 30 meters up, whatever. Yeah. I'm like, yo, why is this shaking? Like, I was like, <laughs> this can't be a joke either. Who the hell's gonna shake? And like, bro, there's an earthquake. Get down, get down. Oh, shit. I was like, oh, shit. I was like, damn, bro. I bet, bro. Shit. You dropped nuts? Yeah, I was, I was like, shit. I don't know what that was. No, at first, when the earthquake came, it shook, yeah. I was like, all right, it's a bit of weird. Then it starts shaking really bad. I'm like, all right, it's an earthquake. Yeah, yeah. It's was it long? I reckon it lasts like four seconds. Damn. I thought that's, that's, that's all right. Yeah. That's kind of long. So you're, you're just snuggling in bed. Nah, I had I was no going through. I was going through diversity, bro. What, what do you diversity? Diversity, now? bro. The natural disaster. Yeah, I guess. But yeah, I, I had no clue. Felt nothing. Bro, but there's still like the light, man. What? Like, I'm fast asleep, bro. I'm not, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah. I remember the 2021 one. I'm pretty sure people wake, woke up from their sleep. Damn, it was that rough, sleeping but that one was really that. short. Like a second or two. Yeah, I think that one that one was shorter than the one that happened last week. Damn. Yeah. What did yeah. anything happen? Like I remember with the one in twenty twenty one, you know the things that they ship on the water in the ships, like the big uh, crates. What is that? What are they the called? Cargoes. Yeah, like, yeah, like yeah, yeah. The big cargoes. Like heaps actually, of them yeah. fell over. Really? Yeah, yeah it was oh. like. Because normally they're all just staying straight. Mm. And then I saw a picture all of them freaking Wasn't there over. something on Chapel Street? That building fell over or something? Really? I don't know. Bro, I, I, I think so. Anything. I think so. I think it happened Probably, like bro. that. Yeah, Chapel Street happened like that. Yeah, big earthquake, bro. Wasn't there? I was going to fire in Danville the other day. Where? You know, oh, yeah, there was. I saw on TikTok. Best way. Is that what it's called? That's my supermarket, bro. Wait, the, the, red, the red one? The green place. Best way. I feel like if you I know the I cheesecake know. shop? Yeah. On the corner. Yeah. If you just walk down, it's just there. Oh. It's like a long. Wait, do you go there? I go there. One minute. Best way. I go best way a fair bit. I've never been there. It's like, it's the old Marmara. It was there before Marmara. Oh yeah. But yeah, it's yeah. A little. Uh, look, I don't, I don't touch that area, bro. You can go there. So what if I mean, you go there? You go there looking for meat. You come back, no shoes, no clothes. Yeah, shit. No car. Bro, I'll park right in front. I go in and out. That's it. <laughs> Simple. You know, I don't, I don't risk anything. But yeah, yeah. I, I don't know if it was a big fire or something. I mean, it looked pretty big on TikTok. They made it look big. That's how it would be, bro. It'll be like something small and send the level. Like, no, Dano is actually a good place. It is. Low key, it really like, is. Like, like, if you go through that little lane. Like with the that, lights, yeah, that with light, the lights, you're like, you're like, damn, bro, like, I'm not, I'm not through this shit with Dano. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, and then it has, like, the clock as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then, and then bro, you, you see the people. Yeah, I mean, it is what it is. I mean, big, big. I think it is the biggest suburb in Melbourne. It's, it's massive, man. It goes. It so actually far is. It's actually really massive, eh? Right? And there's, like, everything there. It's so diverse. What do you mean? Like, Cultural, cultural, yeah, yeah. I think it's it is the most diverse suburb. There's all sorts of food there, all sorts of everything there. Yeah, it's actually crazy. I mean, Beta Squad was there. Yeah, like out of all, how bro? How bad? I was Pereira. Huh? I was Pereira was there as well. Oh, yeah, he was at Fighters Express. I yeah, understand. Yeah. Like, wait, Spanion was there. Yeah, yeah. Why is everyone coming to Dandy all of a sudden? 
I don't I don't know. No, but the most random thing is Chunks and that and Sharky. But then why did then why D Dandy Plaza? That's crazy. Why D Dandy? That's a YD to me, bro. YD. <laughs> the YD drip, bro. That's I crazy. They came in they're like, yeah, this is the this is the good um tuxedo place. Yeah, I guess YD is like the get a tuxedo place. But yeah, it's, yeah, it's where you go if you're poor, poor man tux. <laughs> that was like the graduation pants sort of thing. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? YD or Connor. Yeah, Connor. Yeah, yeah. But like, hey, it's look, not bad. Connor be having baddies. I don't know what it is, what it is bro. bro. Who's hiring the people at Connor? They Hiring agencies is wild, bro. They're even deadly. I bet you the prerequisites is you have to be a good looking girl. Yeah, something I'm like telling that. you, every corner you look at. It has to be. Like, I don't make me want to buy things. <laughs> I want to be a free I wish I had a membership there. I want a membership at Connor. Nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, for real. I don't know what it is. Every corner you look at, there's attractive girls there. Yeah, it's just. I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> yeah look, That's I'm with, like, you. all those songs, like JD, Elite 11. They're all the same, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. But you see, that's whatever. That's like. But I'm talking like. Connor, it's such a weird shop to have girls like that. Anything that's predominantly men's clothing, yeah, is just that. Yeah, that's true. Right? Well, now, mm. that's just a sad reality of life, bro. I you mean, it, it works. I guess it works. Yeah, I think mean, it works for you, especially. But no, it's, it it's does not it work on me, bro. <laughs> it does not work on me. It but yeah, it really work. is like that. Mm. Talk about women. Do you realize? Okay, women compliment each other in front of each other but then they talk shit behind each other's back but then men does men, the opposite yeah. that's what I'm saying that's how it is that's crazy yeah. men will insult in front of you but behind your back they'll talk good about you yeah I've seen so many girls they're like oh my god I hate this person and then we see them oh my god I love your hair I'm like yo what's going on bro I'm like yo didn't you say <laughs> yeah. you hated her the other day what's going on you get used to it bro you actually get used to it in high school it was crazy though you can't even lie in high school bro that was beef like underground beef bro like, yeah we don't know we underground don't know. beef that on the surface level you wouldn't know until, like, hey, until you know you actually, what happened yeah you know what happened bro, last week someone said a fight I'm like what yeah it was in face as well I'm like yo <laughs> what the hell happened bro when how no no, no don't have a fight you miss one day of school you next thing you know, Osama bin Laden came bro. in and like fought Afghanistan on its own. Missing school was the worst thing ever. I don't know what it is. There's always something big that happens in school. I miss school. They're like, yo, Ali, where you at? Why, bro? There's a concert at school. Are you serious? You're missing. I'm like, bro, what? Everything yeah. happened. Everything just happened that same no, day. Bro. You miss out. You miss one day of school. Next thing you know, they're like, bro, Elon Musk was giving away free Teslas. Yeah, you missed out. You missed out, bro. <laughs> Everyone got one except you. You're like, what? Nah, sorry, bro. He said, if you miss out, who's ass? Yeah, literally, it always happens. Oh, you know what's funny is we're talking about school. Bro, those weak ass um fire drills they used to do. Oh man, the bomb threats. Oh, wasn't that one time where s- somebody misses or something? Was Everybody it? was in the oval. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Bomb threat. I'm like, bro, what? What is this, bro? <laughs> yeah, so dead, bro. Oh my. Realistically, God. if a real bomb threat came, oval would be the worst place. You're in the open. Yeah, but like nobody's gonna be able to run in and leave a bomb in the middle and then run away. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. but I'm saying, let's say they have a bomb. What will make them not have a gun? Australia's laws, bro. I don't know. Bro, all right, how do they get the bomb? The bomb's all free. Hey, people can make bombs. Can you? You can make bombs. I guess you can make guns, but it's... it's... No, 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 It's less likely to make guns than bombs. But yeah. I'm saying if... Okay, let's say if a school shooter comes in, what's the drill? Is it behind the tables or something? like? I've never, ever heard of it in school, but I guess under the tables... Oh, this I don't get. When there's a tornado at school or a tornado happening, teachers say, get under the table. How does that prevent anything? No, no, no. It's a genuine question. Have we ever had one? What? No, no, we don't. No, no, but no. but I know when I, when, I was, when I went to Queensland, when I, when I was studying in Queensland, that it used to be that. When, if there's a tornado or something, the drill is get under your table. You should know. You were the one that was in the um, tornado state. No, no, no. But that's what they do. But I don't know yeah, the yeah. reasoning. Bro, oh, I'm in year I three. Know. I don't know what. I'm just yeah. going under the table. I got no clue. Yeah, I don't get it. There must be some sort of science point. It's like with the earthquakes. When it happens, what? just stay under something. or Really? Is that what it is? I don't know. I don't know. Like, well, like, all right, I don't know. When there's a fight, you tuck and roll. What do you mean tuck and roll? You like you tuck and you just roll away. Are you sure? Are you sure? I'm pretty bro? sure, bro. I'm pretty sure. I don't oh, know. It's like the thing, like with the grizzly bear, you play dead. Yeah, look, I don't know about that. <laughs> look, if you see a grizzly bear, I generally just gonna be like, I'll ship it. Hey, let's say you're trapped in a room. I saw this question. Okay, it's like you're trapped in a room, and you're trapped in a room with this. With one of these four animals, which one are you choosing? There's chimpanzee, a, a um, there's chimpanzee, a grizzly bear, and then there's um, I'm pretty sure it's like a tiger, 
or um a gorilla? Bro, what a dumb question is that? Which one you choosing? A freaking chimpanzee, bro. Chimpanzee will rip you apart. They're little. They're not little. Chimpanzees as big as you. Really? Yeah. That's a gorilla, isn't it? No, no, no. Gorilla's huge. Gorilla's like um. Mike Tyson, bro. They're just bashing. No, no. Him. What's the gorilla that died? Harambe. Yeah. Harambe. 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 Yeah, yeah. Harambe. yeah. But a chimpanzee's like um. The movie, the movie, you know, Planet. Oh, yeah, with, with Wait, no, that's Planet apes. apes. That's what I'm that's saying. Apes. Wait, chimpanzees are little. No, what? they're not. I swear they're not, bro. Chimpanzee. Chimpan. Oh, you're gonna hit life, bro. That's what I'm saying. Hold up, bro. <laughs> Technical <laughs> difficulty. I don't know if it's not on Mac. Hold up. Nah, chimpanzee. Bro, they're not that big. All right, bro. <laughs> this is making me up. Bro, chimpanzees are big, bro. Are you serious? The man's a ninja. <laughs> bro, chimpanzees right. are big. Okay. They're human size. Okay. Would you rather a tiger or a grizzly bear? I'm saying grizzly bear. Play dead. Bro, that's all you, but I kind of want to <laughs> live. So personally, I'm going for the chimpanzee. Chimpanzee will rip you in half. That, it's not a gorilla, bro. The it silver is. Bag? You know how strong they are? Bro. Chimpanzees, I'm serious. Like, okay, no, no, no. Chimpanzees I'm someone saying they're weak, but they're not stronger than any of the other animals. They're the yeah, weakest of all the animals. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah. So I'm teaching that. You could f- play dead with a grizzly bit, you'll actually be dead. No, but the thing is with grizzly, what if you actually like learn how to pet it? I think they're pretty cute, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Some videos I see, I'm like, damn, but they're pretty cute. Yeah, like baby bears? Bro, in America, they're so frequent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I swear. It's I, like, like kangaroos here, bro. Yeah. That'll- Same as um crocs in Florida, bro. Uh, alligators, bro. Oh, yeah, alligators. What are the differences, bro? There's actually a big difference. It's the uh, snout. The what? The snout. Like the, the nose, nose thing. The nose, yeah, yeah, but Dude, that's dangerous, bro. <sighs> if I walk outside, I see alligator, bro, I'm not walking outside again. Mm. That's no dangerous. Way. No way. Talk about America. So, Jamie Foxx yeah. acted in America. So, he had... He's in the hospital or something. And, like, the blood clot of his is so bad... That like I think it's like he was about to die. Yeah, he was about to. He was, I he saw was that, about dying, like, like that. Apparently, the doctors said that they should just expect the worst. Yeah, you wanna why? COVID vaccine. Damn. That is crazy, bro. COVID vaccine. That's just one famous celebrity that we know. Yeah. About. If it wasn't on mainstream, who would know? Nah, no one. That's what I'm saying. So there has to be heaps more people that's like suffering from the vaccine. Imagine. And he only got the vaccine because he was he was filming a movie and, and they it. forced him to get it yeah. and he didn't want to get it. He had no choice. He had no choice. He got it, and now look at him. Yeah, I mean, let's say he doesn't die if he can't beg. Would he, like, is there anyone he can sue? Or anyone can, anything he can do? Like, I mean, I don't think so. It's not all really. done now. It's yeah, not it's even done. mandatory now, is it? Yeah, I don't swear. It's not. No one says shit about the yeah. fucking... Yeah, don't think That's so. crazy, I, bro. That I, was I, a wild not stage. Melbourne. Yeah, no, Melbourne. No, no. That was a wild stage, right? One stage, you couldn't do anything without the jab. Yeah, I mean, shout out to the boy Jamal, bro. He was representing the non-vaxxers, bro. Representing Dan. Hey, what's his name? Jamal what? Jamal Labazi, I think. I don't know, but Somewhere respect to him, like, straight out. He was out here fighting for our freedom. Yeah, he was fighting for freedom. That's he why, was, he actually when was. we called Balkan's Corner... Alright, look. Hey, look, Balkan's Corner, please. Last time I called you guys... <coughs> look, we were both hungry. Was this when there was a lockdown? I think this is when the lockdown. It was lockdown, but... Nah, we can't snitch. What the hell? Bro, it's, bro we can't snitch. What the... You're gonna expose the business, bro. <laughs> but yeah, Jamal, man. At one stage, it was crazy in Dallas. It was like... He was. Riots, bro. You look at the news. I'm like, yo, I know that street. That's like freaking whatever road. Wait, there was actually, I'm pretty sure there was riots in North as well. Oh, really? North as well? Yeah. And then, yeah, the people that were just but going on walks, like, we're walking on our, and there's like a thousand people, and like, <laughs> we're all walking separately, coincidentally bro, at the same the time. The COVID riots were too funny. Yeah. The COVID fight, you remember the, the big fight in the city? Horses got punched for no reason. Yeah. Why are you punching the horse? Right. It's not their COVID fault. COVID split people more apart than anything else. <laughs> yeah, it, it really showed real and fake, but who showed who's who, who's had yeah. this, that. That's crazy though, man. Horses getting punched left Yeah, right. like, bro, you see the videos that the horse is there. He just gets punched. I'm like, what? Yeah, You're running away the punching horse, the horse. Bro. Like, the horse, what's bro. the point we'll do? No, they did not deserve it's, it, bro. It's crazy, man. Cool. Yeah, that thing really split everyone apart. It went on for so long as well. It did. It actually went. But like the snap so lockdown. Like at the start of the snap, I'm like, yes, I mean, snap Melbourne lockdown. was um the longest. In the the world. longest, yeah, in the world. Yeah, I was like, how crazy is that? Yeah, but wow, that's us, bro. <laughs> I'm like, yes, snap lockdown. No school. It's like eight months, bro. At like six, seven months long. But do you miss it? Look, sometimes I'm like, I wouldn't mind like a sneaky one week snap lockdown, <laughs> like a one week rest, <laughs> one week break from everything. You know, sailing going on. Nah, but um. You know, it's actually a thing where people um have 
um, they reminisce the 2020 lockdown. Yeah, they it's were... an actual study, like saying like people actually genuinely miss it that much. Bro, there's so many people that just lived on their computers. Like obviously, yeah, that was me. That was me. I was, I was we were just gaming. Yep. That was prime FIFA. Yeah, and GDA. Yeah, GDA, FIFA. Man. All the games popped off. If you bro. were in school in that year, you live life. No, no, no. If you went in year 12 that year, you live life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were in year 12, bro. We had a sheath. Like, we didn't have anything you enjoy. Yeah. COVID 2020, if you went in year 12, you live life. I'm sorry. It's just like that, bro. If yeah. you went in year 12, you live life, bro. Pretty much. Bro, like, you put me... Imagine if I was year 8 in 2020. If Imagine if it was year 10, bro. Yeah, Doesn't 11 year, No, year anything. Bro, I'm but 12, I'm like, bet. Even then, in year 12, we'll be like, oh, wake up, sign in, back to bed. Wake <laughs> up. Yes. And then wake up, yo. No, obviously, some said no cool, some said cool. But the no cool ones, this is sign in, back, back to bed. And then, message, who's playing GDA? Bang, bang, up, up on a heist. That was the best. <laughs> yeah. Bro. Uh, did you hear about GDA 6? Apparently, might cost 500 bucks or something like that. Yeah. I also heard that you can... Take your money you make on that and put it in real life. Piss off! I saw it, bro. I don't no, know. You can't, bro. I, I don't know. Aaron, what is the trust? Trust me, bro. The source is trust bro, me, bro. Well, well, that's what I saw. Did yeah. you tag me in it? No, I didn't tag you. No, I I tagged you in something where it's like the bucks. game's costing five hundred. Yeah, that's wild. Like bro. Lester better be giving me a real life high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's like, what's that's your fun? <laughs> He's like, what's your personal email address, bro? I'm gonna send you this. <laughs> yeah, like, and then we the better be sending a real life high, bro. Yeah, it's a funny one. Yeah, that uh, any game like look, hundred bucks is the most for any game. Bro, hundred bucks is steep. It, it's steep, but bro, FIFA unless you do price match. It, any OG person knows you got a price match with like yeah. Look, if you're buying straight from EB, that's why EB games going broke, bro. They're yeah. charging new games ninety nine ninety five. No one is getting that. They just go JB high. Yo, like price 70. match. I target. Yeah, I mean, I price match because I still want from EB games. Like, yeah, because bro, if you sell from Kmart, it's dead. You got to sell from EB games. No, or JB Hi-Fi. Nah, yes, but even man. then, I feel like most people just buy it online now. Yeah, nowadays, everyone's online. Especially with the new PlayStation having, like, the only online. Yeah, the I'm digital like... edition, yeah. Makes sense, though. I mean, even though online is more convenient. Because, what, you have, like, disc trays and all that, like... Yeah, I, I, I just... I like the traditional like way. It. Yeah, yeah, I just like having the disc. I don't know oh, why. I just like having... Fair enough, fair. You like the whole things, eh? Sorry? You like the whole things, like, physically. You yeah, yeah, exactly, stuff, yeah. yeah. Like, you know, I can see it. I'm like, yeah, it's my game, bro. <laughs> nah. Remember back then, I don't know if you did this, when we used to buy games, the first thing we'd do was look at the manual before we get home. It, it yeah. Used... Bro, do you remember those? On ones? the way home, you're so excited, like, yeah, yeah, let me see, yeah, let me see. look at the moves and everything. Not that, but you just like, they so excited to play it. You know yeah. that? They really? don't have that anymore, no. What do they have now? Like, oh, you have to get 15 plus to play this? Or... Yeah, that, that stuff. But they don't actually have like, all that like, games like, up is to move, like, that is yeah. crazy, eh? Hey? Back then, bro. I remember... I used to be in the car, like getting games for you. On my way home, I open it already. I'm looking at what to move on. You just suss out the games. Yeah. Those are the days, man. Those were actually the days, like. Man, I think- now it's wobbling. Now, like, you can only enjoy FIFA occasionally or something with yeah, your friends. That's, friend. that's older, it. Though. Yeah, yeah. Guess. But even then, you know, I'm starting to realize the free games are the ones that's popping off crazy now. Yeah, not. It's not the. It's Back not then, like, game. I don't think the free games were all that. Like, now there's, like, what, Valorant? And Fortnite, I think, especially made it so big. Pop, like, Fortnite popped off for games overall so much. Like, yeah. You know, so, many, like, so many people, because it was available on every platform free. Yeah, I think it was like that, yeah. They really, um, like... Changed the game. Changed the game. Industry. Yeah, really did, eh? It really did, yeah. Because was... of them, there's heaps of Battle Royals now. Yeah, so, like, God has... I've seen, so, I've seen some with, like, it's a car Battle Royale. I've seen... Well, yes, but, like, car... <laughs> I've seen... All sorts of things. People make a battle royale of anything. Like battle royale always existed, but it wasn't <laughs> mainstream. It never popped off. It was just always like there, but with like um PUBG. Yeah, it's PUBG or like Minecraft Hunger Games. I don't play Minecraft. Ah, uh, but yeah, they, Minecraft, Minecraft Hunger Games. I reckon was the OG. Like I could never buy myself a PC and play games like that. What Minecraft? You can play on your phone. Nah, it's just Minecraft. You were never into Minecraft. Still, nah, never, bro. Bro, do you people used to play Minecraft at school and say it's work. Yeah, like bro, Nova. Yeah, Nova. Everyone played Nova. Bro. You played Nova. Yeah. Dream League? Yeah, Dream League was good as well. Dream League, Nova was crazy, man. I, I miss those days in school. It was, it was. So now let's get into a subject. Um, So I saw this Reddit post that uh, I want I want us to read. I've never, I haven't read it. I just read the title. I'm like, this is interested oh, me. Yeah. Who I'll, I'll, I'll pull it out. I'll pull it out. So this guy posted, okay, he said, my girlfriend is still close to her ex. Bro, you don't know what this guy. <laughs> So this guy we have, he said, 
My girlfriend is best friend with her ex. We have a long distance relationship with six hour drive apart. Look, it's looking rough for my man. Look, uh, what are you saying? It's looking like free gym. Free gym, hoodie on, he said, headphones. I've been together with her for four months now, and I knew in the beginning that they were close friends. So he knew they used to date and they're still close friends, and he still went for it. Look, that says look. enough. Yeah, that. Check the hat off. That says enough, brother, man. Look, uh, I, don't, I don't know what to say. Honestly, right. that says enough. Like, come on now. If, brother, you, look, 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 bro, if you and someone love each other, whatever, you guys can't be friends. <laughs> it's you, you guys either never loved each other. Oh, I still love in love with each other. Yeah, look, it's one another. My brother, she she was never yours. She she was never yeah. yours, my man. If she's she like, was, if she's she like, yours, look, bro. I love you, but like my ex is in my life. We've really matured up and we've understood each other, and now we're best friends. <laughs> Don't do it, bro. Don't do it. She, he, look, I, I have to say he did it for himself, bro. Yeah, but he. <clears throat> you're you're walking. It's like you're seeing a trap. You're walking into it. You're seeing you pain. Shoot yourself in the foot, bro. Yeah, you're like bang, bang. What are you doing to yourself? All right, let's keep going. He said they ventilate and also have a cat together, so she has a key to his apartment as she frequently goes there to take care of the cat. Damn, brother, bro. is she taking care of the cat or he's taking care of her cat? Which yeah, one, bro? I don't know. That's Which actually one? crazy. That's wild. So, how is this guy accepted this in the first place? I'm, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't understand how this works. Like, how do you say? No, what kind of shit friends does he have, <laughs> bro? If my if you come up to me like like Ali, bro, like hey, cause there's a girl I've been speaking to. I, I think she's the one. I'm like, really, bro? Hectic, man. This uh, what's about her? But the only thing is like, I feel really lucky that I'm matured up. She's matured up so much. She goes to her ex's house and feeds the cat. <laughs> I'm saying, bro, are you serious? Leave, leave. Don't do this yourself. This guy's friends. They just said, yeah, bro. Yeah. That's happened. That's crazy, man. He said. At first, it didn't really bug me that they were friends, but it bugs me that she spends more time with him than me. Damn. That look, it's looking rough on my man. At this point, who's the who's the ex? Yeah. Who's the ex at this point? There's no ex, bro. Hmm? There's no ex. There's, There's no just ex. two boyfriends. And then he said, after oh no, I already read that. He said, um, it bugs me that she seeks comfort when venting to him and not me. Call yeah. me jealous, and I am. I mean, bro, you're yeah, not no, jealous. I mean, you're just more than jealous. I think you're just a cock at that point. Yeah, at that point, you're watching your missus be stabbed to the other guy. You're just like, hey, babe, I like, miss you. I'm sorry, my... <clears throat> Hold up. I'm praying for this guy. <laughs> yeah, this, I'm praying wild, for this bro. guy. This guy needs help. 16 hours ago, bro. 16 hours ago. He posted this 16 hours ago. Look, uh, That's fresh as well. Yeah, it's fresh. It's fresh news. That's crazy. So, let me read it. His, I'm just going to put... Maleficent fix five five eight one. My brother, we are here with you, supporting you. What's Maleficent? That's his. That's his username. That's oh, his oh username. Maleficent. Yeah, we're, yeah. We're here supporting you, bro. We're here supporting you. You need better friends. Yeah. Anyway, he said, um, of course, I think you should have friends in the opposite opposite gender, but it's the part when it's her ex. Bro, more than ex, yeah. If she's if she's gone to a male friend's house. Yeah, to take care of a cat. Bro, I mean, I'm sure there's a cat to be taken. Yeah. <laughs> Why is she at a male friend's house in the first place? What is this? What kind of dumb thing is this? Yeah. And he said, I've talked to her <coughs> about this, about this, that it really irritates me and it makes me upset. She told me that she would never cheat on me and that she can block him because she doesn't want to upset me like this ever again. And in my mind, I'm thinking, am I wrong for wanting her to cancel a four-year relationship with her ex? So he feels guilty that he's going to stop her from having a four-year relationship kind with her What kind of gaslighting is that? Is it gaslighting? Is it, bro? Wait, why does he feel guilty though? Maybe he's, that's what I'm saying. Why does he feel guilty? She says she would. If that's me, I'm. Pff, y'all can lock me up, bro. I'm telling you, it sounds <laughs> menaceful <laughs> things, but that's that's just disgusting. I feel bad for this guy, bro. I don't. He, he knew about this. Yeah, he, he knew about this. Initially, still when you spoke to her, and she's like, "Yeah, me and my ex, we have a friendship. I go to his house sometimes, and he still, he still was like, yeah, okay, why one? And he still went in. Yeah, like, come on now, like, you can't be that oblivious, my brother." Yeah, you just... You're doing to yourself. <laughs> you're legit, bro. And then he said, um... Where were we? He said, okay, after a two long... After a two hour long conversation about this... Wait, wait. Two hour long conversation about this, about her. She asked me for one request slash demand of him. 
I'll demand of this that she still needs to ventilate towards him. So she still needs to vent about her life to her ex. So what is the point of Bucky? No, more than that, brother, I think it's because he can take care, he can de-stress her. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? It's because he can relieve Listen, her stress. Listen, bro, he is there. He's that guy, bro. <laughs> he, Maleficent, he just ran away. Look, he, uh, I don't know what to say, bro. I don't know what to say. And then he said, am I a fool for giving her a chance? It's, more than a fool, man. It's looking rough, my man. You're just... He said... I don't know what to do. She says I'm overthinking and overreacting. As she explained to me, there's nothing going on between those two. Look. So that's not gaslighting. He's Stevie Wonders could see there's something happening and yeah. he's blind. Yeah, that's what he's I'm blind. saying. Right? He's yeah. blind and he knows something going on. Um, that's just pretty <laughs> shit, bro. Like, you really... I would, like, come on now. How do people allow this? I don't know. How like, to... how do you have to be raised in a way to say, yeah, it's fine that she's friends with her ex... Like, Regularly go to his house, vents to him. Yeah, look, that's where it crossed. No, bro, what? Hey, line. hey, that's man, not... what do you mean? That's where it crossed the line. No, 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 no. Like that's like it already crossed the line when she says she vents to him. Like any con, no, bro, the whole thing's any a line. Type, yeah, any type of contact with an ex is just a red flag. Any sentence that doesn't include ex and blocked, <laughs> if it's ex and talking, come on now, nah, just yeah, it's looking the rough. Line, bro. My man, look. It's just not a good mix, And bro. the fact that he had to ask this on Reddit, he had to actually ask, he genuinely needs advice, I feel bad for him. Where's his friends? You're right. That's what I'm saying, his bro. His friends must be saying, bro, it's all good. Bro, stop overreacting. Have respect for her relationship with her ex. That's tough, bro. That's crazy, bro. What would you so, do? What would I do? I wouldn't be in there in the first place. Bro, the thing is, he said, my girlfriend is best friends with her ex. What if, yeah? Okay. You didn't know about this. Yeah. You're talking to her, you get obsessed with her, like you really have you really yeah. love her. And then she's like, Oh yeah, also me and my ex are still in contact, we're still friends, this, that. And what if, what if mm-hmm. you you knew the guy and you thought they were just friends? Yeah. Oh. She never said ex. Oh. And then and then and then Shit. you find out after you go like, you're officially like she's the one, this that. She's like, by the way, let's say Mark is my ex. Damn, bro. What do you do Sheesh. then? You're already in, you're two foot in, you're in there. Nah, it, it'll be, you think about all those times where she's like, I'm going out with Mark. Yeah, you start see his, see him in your head. Yeah, she's like, I'm studying. With Mark. With Mark. Look, she's studying about the different angles. That's why she's studying at this point. Brother, I'm telling you, there's, there's only one cat that's getting taken care of, and it's not the animal. This story is just there's gonna be a lot of st- There's going to be a lot of study dates, but honestly, <laughs> what would you do for the situation? You're, I don't say it, bro. I'll just block it out. That's not happening. <laughs> it's not that's happening. Not happening. Like, it's not happening, but if you really, I like, reckon you have to slowly detach yourself. Yeah. It won't, it won't happen straight away, but I reckon like three months. I reckon I'll make a whoop on my phone. What? Of like, I'll make his name like Mark or mm-hmm. best friend or something on my phone where anytime I look at it, it reminds me and then I'll have to get over it. That's yeah, the only yeah, way. Yeah, I think, I think that's, that's the only way. Yeah, you have to slowly detach yourself. You can't, you can't do it straight away. Yeah, no. Nah, <clears throat> but what you can't do is say, like, it's be insecure about it. You just have to let it be. You can't force someone to stay. Like, no. insecure about it as in, like... What? Is it not insecure if you just say, no, you got to block him? No, 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 I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. But I'm saying in a way where you're, like, begging her to stay. No, but there's nothing to stay. She's already staying. If anything, you oh. just have to be like, hey, you got to block him out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fair enough. No, right, you, yeah, like, yeah. she's not leaving. I was thinking, like, what if she leaves? No, 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 she's not leaving. What if she was like, if you can't accept my friend with me, I'm leaving. Oh, oh, then, then leave. Yeah, please then leave. Then do me a favor. Yeah, do me a favor. That's crazy. That's crazy. But yeah, I reckon the standards now with people are crazy, man. I mean, How would you feel guy. with your missus if she was like friends at all with her with the ex or whatever? Jeez, I don't know. Like you can't do that. I you just can't. It's just disrespectful. Yeah, I feel like it is. Like, it is what it is, bro. Yeah, I mean, shit. <clears throat> all right, the next story. Okay, so another user submitted a um a story for us to read. It says. The, the the title is This is hard But I think my girlfriend Is cheating on me Can anyone help? Okay so <clears throat> So this guy said I went onto a TikTok And found out She's simping for a different guy I've confronted her about it And she said It was her cousin Meanwhile She was FaceTiming him At 4am And I asked a buddy of mine To see who <clears throat> To see who it is And see if she's cheating on me And she said nearly Wait, What the What? How did he nearly cheat? Yeah, how do you nearly cheat? I, 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 like, 
No, no, never mind. What the f- is what's going on? I don't know. We're just totally fucked up. I don't know what to do as I got a screenshot from my friend saying she liked the guy more than me. Jesus, bro. That is fucked Oh fuck. my God. That's fucked. What do you do at that point? You just look at the text. She likes you more than me. Oh. What do you do? How do you handle those feelings? Jesus Christ. I, I, I have no words. And then he said, when me and the guy chatted, he was extremely toxic and she didn't even tell him we were dating. So, he's talking about the guy that she's been FaceTiming so at 4 a.m. He spoke with the guy. Yeah, he spoke with the guy and she didn't. She never told the other guy that they were dating. Damn. Look, it's another story, my brother. She, she was never yours. Wait, what should I do? Yeah. He should said, I end he, the relationship or not? As she did apologize. What? Bro, there's no apology. <laughs> the apology is too late, my brother. It's done. How does the apology help at that situation, bro? So, okay. <laughs> you don't even need the whole story. Simply, a guy and a girl are dating. She's talking to this other guy that's not her boyfriend more. She introduced a guy and her boyfriend, but she doesn't tell the other guy that she's dating the boyfriend. Yeah. I mean, that's enough said. And she's nearly cheating? She, yeah, how do you nearly cheat? Is it that you cheat or you don't? If you know, put in the comments, because I've never heard of someone nearly cheating. I mean, it depends. No, no. You could nearly physically cheat, but you can always emotionally cheat. Yeah, I don't think that's what girls do, bro. What? She was emotionally cheating. Both, it bro. It seems like both. But it was just on, on TikTok. Have they met in real life? It was oh, insane. yeah, it was yeah that's true. Yeah, no, yeah. but like, even overall, girls that, that only emotional always cheat. emotionally cheat. Really? Like, majority of the time, girls emotionally cheat. What do you think is worse? Emotionally cheating or physically cheating? <sighs> it's so like, uh, look, it's a double-edged sword. because they're both. But I reckon I'd rather you emotionally cheat than physically. Really? Yeah. Bro, but if she emotionally cheats... She's already checked out of your relationship. She's gone. Like, she can be with you, whatever, physically. She can be next to you. Yeah. You can be out with her, but her mind's about on another guy. Mm, that's true. But at the same time, physically, damn, bro. Bro, I'm sorry, my bro. I'm sorry, bro. It's... I wouldn't wish out on my enemy. No, you don't. No, you I don't. don't. Like, you let's don't, say, don't. let's say I hate you. I'll say, look, bro, I want you to die, but I think we're cheating on, bro. Like, shit. Yeah, no one physically anything. cheating, emotionally cheating. Such a tough subject, but I reckon... Fi- I don't know. I reckon, personally, me, I reckon they, they, I'd rather them emotionally cheat. You? I think... I don't know. I You'd think, have to pick one. I'll be physically, bro. What? I'll be physically. Really? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I guess it's like, like that's where, like, what we... I don't know. It's like... It's because with emotionally... would stand more? With emotionally, she can be cheating on me for six months. Like, she can be talking to another guy, this, that. Mm. I'll never know. She wants to... He's a friend, he's a friend, he's a friend. And then, one day... When she's properly checked out, she's just like, hey, I'm in love with this person. Mm-hmm. I don't want you. Then she's gone. Okay. Or would you rather her be like, yeah, I piped this guy. This wasn't before the right. This is during the relationship. At least, bro, then she should just say it and run away or something, bro. That's what I'm saying. I'm, it's... I don't know what to say. I might kill myself. Because with emotional cheating, okay, yes, she checked out, but... She never physically did anything the is, during the relationship. If she's emotionally cheating for six months, you think she'll never do anything? No, but we're just Overall, hypothetically. One hypothetically, another, one yeah, another. Yeah, one another. Yeah, I guess. You see, that's what that's how I draw the line. Because technically, once you break up... Like, I guess it's no... true, because I was thinking, cause even if it's emotionally, you can't really get back together. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's a, yeah, I was really thinking, if she's emotionally cheated... Yeah, you're right, yeah, probably physically then. But then, I've asked girls about this, and they'd rather... They get cheated physically. Yeah. Because girls are obviously more emotional. Yeah, than of men. course. But yeah. <clears throat> Me, personally, I'm choosing... Fi- I'd rather you emotionally cheat. Either one's worse. There's no good answer. There's no good answer, exactly. But yeah, maybe emotionally. Yeah, I mean, it's just At like- least, if it's, if it's emotionally, I won't have to like... I won't ever envision like... Oh, if, no, nah. no. You don't want that. You, those are the reason you have nightmares. No, that doesn't mean you won't have nightmare because you can't sleep. Yeah, you can't, yeah, sleep. You can't sleep. Free weight loss, free workout, free <laughs> lifestyle change, free everything, bro. Everything for free. You get free money because you just work. Yeah, you work. Unless you're one of those guys that just doesn't work and they're just like, what? You're just a bum. Then they you just suffer. Then you just, you're getting like you, anxiety, you depression, suicidal yeah. thoughts. Your life's ruined. Yeah. But yeah. yeah. <laughs> right, anyway, back to this guy. This guy's saying she pretty much cheated. Pretty please much. help. Yeah, please help. Now, the audacity, look, look, where are these guys' friends? I don't know. But I guess... I mean, Would you be did... embarrassed to tell your friends? Yeah, you're actually right. Would you be embarrassed That's to tell a... your friends? No, I, I wouldn't be embarrassed to tell you, because you're very yeah, close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, 
But I reckon, like, majority friends, yeah, I would be. Yeah, probably. Would Most you? friends, I'd be like, I can't say. If they ask, let's say, how's your missus? Because that's your honest how's man. So and so, I'm like, yeah, she's good. I'm not saying anything. Yeah, I can't. that's actually a good point. It's because, like, your, yeah, exactly. Your dignity is gone. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. what happened? She cheated on me with a guy on TikTok. Yeah, that's why, like, it, yeah, 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 that's actually a good point. Now that you think, like, yeah. That's Maybe, why, like, yeah. You can't really get mad at people if they don't tell you stuff. Because, like, yeah, because it's just somewhat embarrassing for them. Yeah, like, she oh, is, yeah. I'd be understanding that it is. Yeah. That's true. That's a very good point. But yeah, um, at least he talked to someone. He said, "Ask buddy of mine to see who, who, no, to see if she cheated on me." And she said, "Nearly." So it's a female friend. Yeah, it's a female friend that he asked. Uh, female <coughs> friend said, you, "No." Hmm? I have a female friend said, "Why you leave?" Yeah, for real. I mean, that's crazy. I don't know what to do. As I got a screenshot from my friend saying she liked that guy more than me. Well, that how do you fall in love with someone over online? I don't know how that works. Like, back in school, you you have a crush over text, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but that's that's different. Over school, you actually see them. No, no, let's say... Oh, from no, another school. Yeah, even if it's something like that. Oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. when you're younger, you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah But exactly. when it's, like, online, I don't know how it works. Like, it happens a lot, but how does it even work? Maybe you just, you just talk to the person a lot, and you just... Do you fall in love with that persona, that personality of the Yeah, that you know? personality, and, like... Yeah, I But that can that. be so deceiving. How? Like, bro... Over text and no, no, calls. but obviously FaceTiming and okay, so okay. you see what they it's look like. It's so easy like, to fake things. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah it is. Yeah, obviously, yeah. Whereas once you're with them, when something happens, they can't fake it. So you know what I'm saying? Like mm. they can. It's so deceiving. Like it really is, bro. You'll be like obsessed over someone, then it's someone <coughs> completely different when you actually see it. Yeah, it's it's tough, bro. These, uh, it's an evil world, nowadays bro. with all those like dating apps and stuff it can happen. Yeah, here, and catfishes. Bro, Cat- some catfish. Sto- some catfish are deadly, bro. Some catfishes. I'm like, holy. Yeah. What is the like? Hey, how does this happen? Yeah, but then the good ones are the reverse catfish, where they look bad in pictures. Yeah, there's also some like that where like in pictures, I'm like, bro, it's dead. Yeah. And I'm like, yo, is this the same person I was going? Yeah, in? exactly. That happens exactly. Like, That happens heaps. Yeah, I reckon like most most um pretty girls actually look bad in pictures. Yeah. Do you agree? I agree. Yeah. What about guys? What? What are guys? Yeah, you reckon they look better in pictures or worse in pictures? I don't know. Personally, I think I look worse in pictures. I'm just not photogenic. Yeah, fair enough. But yeah, most pretty girls and the less pretty girls yeah. look better in pics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a few you're like, damn. And then you're like, yo, is this the same person that I mm. like? see? Like, makeup change work? a lot as well, bro. It really does. Like some of the makeup... Makeup, lighting, angles, heaps of stuff. Yeah, Photoshop. there's so many There's things. so much editing apps. That's yeah. why as well. Well, they like... The makeup, bro, the lighting itself and the angle. If you take it like this and like this, <laughs> big difference, bro. It it's is, a whole it is. human you, change. Because, like, let's say you have a double chin, you could hide it by going up here. Yeah, it is. But the makeup is crazy, bro. It's an evil world for men out here, bro. Like, some makeup videos I see, bro, before the thing I see, I'm like, what? And then afterwards, it's, it's a supermodel from France or something like that. Yeah. I'm like, damn, how does this change so much? Oh, my God. He's, that was this is actually a good time. So you know how I'm like falling in love over online, bro. That's what the Tinder Swindler is about. You remember that guy? It's a Netflix documentary. You should watch it, yeah. Bro, this guy scammed heaps of girls. Oh yeah, over yeah. Tinder. It's real, yeah. It's real. It's real, yeah, yeah, I yeah, 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 yeah. He's crazy, bro. He's he still says out. Like, He's out right now, lurking. Is he meant to get arrested or something? Yeah, or? yeah. He was meant to, he he, meant, he was meant to get arrested or something. He went out, bro. It's so crazy. This guy has like so many identities. Yeah, he just keeps thinking. Because it's so easy. It's crazy, bro. Now, bro. If you search, I'm pretty sure you can buy, like, but a card. It's like, you can change everything online. Like, you make 30 accounts, you buy a bunch of SIM cards, a mm-hmm. bunch of numbers. If you speak to someone desperate long enough, let's say you speak to them one month of, you know, consistent talk, you, you never know, meet up, whatever. <clears throat> Do you know what he did? No. So what he did was, um, so let's say me and you talking. So on his, on his Tinder profile, he has, like, all these, like, He's only flying first first class and all that stuff. But then all the money that he gets is from the girls that he's scamming. So it starts off with like, say you see him as a rich guy. He'll, he'll be like, yo, this guy's rich, this, that. He flies you out and that, that, yeah. And then out of nowhere, he'll be like, no, no. He would try to portray himself as like, he's a rich guy. So there's heaps of people out for him. Yeah. And then later in the relationship, he would tell the girl, yo, I'm about to get like, Kidnapped. I'm about to get kidnapped. I need this much money, this, that. She sends him the money, and then he used the money to maintain that lifestyle and scam another girl. And then it keeps going and yeah. going and going. He might as well put it up in a business at that point, bro. 
No, straight up, that is crazy. It is. It is. Because, like, bro, there will be so many desperate people online. Like, so no. many desperate and people. And there's heaps of girls that actually, like, take loans out of, like, the bank and everything. For him. For him. Fuck. This girl, and guess what? Like, even though there's a documentary out about him, she still has to pay the loan off. Yeah, I mean... He doesn't pay she, it. She still has to pay off the loan. Because it's under her name. That is crazy, bro. Is it like... Is it like Running away from cops, or he's just so free. No, nah, no, nah, he's like, he's like, oh, there's people out getting me. No, 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 like, right now. Yeah. Since he's actually everyone, but he knows him, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's running away from the cops. government because he's technically scamming. His, like, identity. Identity. Yeah, 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 identity like yeah, yeah, yeah. That stuff. Damn. I mean, it's not that hard nowadays. It's bro. crazy, bro. It's crazy. Yeah, like, even the scams, everyone. There's so many scams. Like what, bro? Like the messages you get. What do you mean? Bro, my God, messages, oh, yeah, eBay yeah, messages, yeah. delivery crazy, messages. Bro. Some days I'm just like posters arriving here to redeem it. I'm like, yo, I'm like, yo what I order, bro? Bro, the other day I nearly fell for it because I was expecting a message from MyGov. Yeah, yeah. And it's like, oh, you have a MyGov message. Click the link. I went into a MyGov app straight because I was like, shit, yeah. I, I got it. I'm like, oh, there's no message. Then look, a number sent it to me, bro. Luckily, I didn't click the link. Wait, what would happen if you press the link? Yeah, I don't, I don't want to find out. Like, I want to, but I don't want to. I don't want to be able to find out. Why don't you click it? No, I haven't got no one. You will have some sort of link on your phone, bro. I don't know. I don't want to link They send it. Yeah, but yeah. I wonder how does it work. Like, once you click it, that's it? Yeah, I think. No, no. I'm pretty sure once you click it, they'll tell you to fill out a form with your bank details. All right. No way, bro. <laughs> yeah, no way. Know, no retail. Like, right, oh, find yeah. out. Let's find out right now. Man, live. Fuck off. I'm live. I'm live, live. Live. Oh, <laughs> shit, bro. Next week, we can't afford. We have to sell all these things. Yeah. Well, <laughs> so back in like two years, three years ago in lockdown, they used to be like the, do you know how the black market websites or something like that? So in the group chat, this guy was sending like through like, oh yeah, this is a black market. He he literally said, press this. It says press the link and you'll die. And he's like, can someone press it? <laughs> I'm like, bro, why don't you find out yourself? He's like, press the link and it says people will rock up at your house. I'm like, bro, I'm not. <laughs> and it, the link's not even like HTTPS. It's like some other stuff, some black market underground web. He's like, press it and people will show up at your house. I'm like, what? I'm not gonna pray you press it. What's the school friend was random? No, it's a school friend. It's a school friend. Oh, far out, man. This nah. guy is so random, bro. I'm telling you. He's like, press the link and people will rock up at your house. He sent it in the group chat. Never no one shit, pressed bro. it. Well, Everyone just said, you press it. He's like, nah, I'm not pressing it. Yeah, press I'm it. not pressing that's, that's. Would you believe that stuff now? Yeah. Would you? Bro, no one rock up at your house, bro. I mean, if, if it's like some weird ass. Uh, do you remember what the Arabic stuff people used to say? <laughs> Do you know what the Arabic stuff? Who uses the iPad? It's just on the iPad. The, uh, the Arabic. Right? You said you had the iPad shot someone. Well, I used to spend yeah. the time. Wait, did you have to open it or did you send it? And it just, and it just shuts down. Do you not do that? I think I've heard of my notes. No, I'm telling you. So the iMessage thing will pop up, pop down, and it shuts off your iPad. <laughs> I swear to you! Is it gonna message two people? What is it? What? Why? I don't know. I don't know. So, when I say shuts it up, it doesn't shut up, but like, it makes your iPad freeze and like, it turns off, <laughs> and you just need to turn it back on. It's. People are spamming it. I swear to you, I'm not lying. So, the people, let me know. I'm telling you, the Arabic writing, you send it through iPad on iMessage, it, it shuts your iPad off. Fuck. Yeah, it was crazy, but it stopped working after like a week. So, you send it and. But if you send nothing happens to yours. Nothing happens to yours. It's just if you receive it. Yeah, yeah, if you receive it. How crazy is that? Yeah, you just pretty much Wait, just you don't know about nah. that. What? Oh yeah, so those you. links are pretty funny where it's like, oh, click the link if you want to see someone get murdered. I'm like, bro, why would I click that link? I'm never pushing that link. Oh my God. I don't know what it was, but I'm telling you, it, it, it did. I'm telling you, it did. That was oh, crazy, that's funny, bro. man. That was what time is it now? I think nine. I mean, it's eight. Okay. <sighs> We've actually talked about a lot today. Now I feel like I thought, I don't know how long this got. I reckon it's gone 40, 50 minutes. Yeah, around forty. Should we end it off? Yeah. Yeah, we'll just yeah, that, yeah, we'll end it off right now. Yeah. Thanks for listening. I mean, today we actually talked about a lot, bro. Look, the two guys that the Reddit stories that we read. Hey, hey let me know what would you do. Like, yeah. would you stay or leave? You, you have to. You leave. have to leave, man. You have to just leave. you have to leave you have for your own leave. dignity. Even if you're obsessed with the you have kids, just leave. <sighs> it's a tough situation, bro. It's a tough situation. I pray no one goes through it. It's suffering. Would you rather suffer because you left, you're hurt, you're depressed, you're angry, or suffer because you stayed? Now you now you can't sleep. You're stuck with her. You hate your life. It's Which almost you like okay. It's almost like 
would you suffer in a way where like you're stitching a wound or the knife is still in the wound? Yeah, pretty much. That's what it is. That's what it is. Would yeah. you rather stick the knife out and start stitching or just leave it there? Yeah, both will be painful. It's just which one would you rather be? Yeah. That's, Damn, hey, that's actually that's deep, deep quote, right? eh? That's what I'm saying, bro. You know, I'm just saying. That's deep like that. That's deep. That's actually crazy. You can that's think true. about it. Yeah. Both are painful. It's just one, it'll hurt to fix it. But then once the healing's done, you'll be fine. Yeah. One, Even if it's like the knife is whatever. there. And if the knife is still there, one day or another, you're going to have to take it out. But it, it doesn't move around as well, but that knife, uh, every time, yo, around. I'm venting. Uh, yo, I've got to feed the cat. Uh, every day, bro. Every day that thing's happening, bro. She's feeding the cat for sure. I'm telling you that. That's enough said, bro. I can't feast it, bro. It's yeah, deadly. Free the guy. Me, uh, let me check his name, bro. Oh, fuck. Where is it? Maleficent, Maleficent. Yeah, Maleficent, Fix 5581. We are with you. I'm praying for you, bro. I'm praying for you. I'm praying know. you can find better friends, bro. Yeah, like, seriously. Even the other guy from TikTok. Free him as well. Yeah, free the other guy as well. Like, the I'm... fact that he has to ask that is pretty depressing. Yeah. It's an evil world, bro. It's an evil world. Anyways. It's an evil world. Yeah, thanks for watching. Yeah, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Comment down what you do with the friends part. Yeah. Please. We'll... Shit, if you have any stories to tell us, please, yeah. we'll read it. Or link anything we can yeah, see. Yeah, yeah, please. Just read it. We'll have our opinion on it. Yeah. All right, thanks for listening. See ya. It tastes good like soul food. Parked up outside in the old school. The new me back with the OU. The dog always.